Behind the scenes in my IVF lab, let's talk about ICSI, intracytoplasmic sperm injection. This is one way we fertilize eggs with IVF. We typically do this to eggs a few hours after they're retrieved, and we are able to check their success the following day. It starts with putting sperm into a thick media. Think about like caro syrup, corn syrup. It's thick, and so they can't swim very fast. We have to nick their tail so they don't actually swim out of the egg. And then we pick up the sperm tail first into this small injecting pipette. It is so small. It's hard to even see with your bare eyes. It is the smallest needle in the world. Now, this takes extreme precision and skill. We need to inject the egg at a very specific angle to not damage internal organelles of the egg. The polar body is a small circle of extruded DNA from the meiosis process. This needs to be at the bottom or top 90 degrees from injecting. When the needle goes into the egg, we then have to draw back some of the egg cytoplasm so we can make sure we're in the right portion of the egg. The sperm is then gently injected and instilled right in the middle of the egg. Next day, we can tell if these eggs are fertilized and able to make a baby.